is larger than life. It is called... Texas High School Football. Only one show can bring the greatest sport from the greatest state into focus. Lone Star Gridiron. Lone Star Great Irons, Glenn McCarty here with Zach Lockenfora and Michael Purcell. Uh, great win tonight. Y'all are rolling along. I mean, y'all got a great team and, and a great defense. Talk, uh, Zach, talk a little bit about the defense first. That um, our defense is really senior. Or we have a lot of seniority in the defense. And we've all grown up playing together and having a bunch of fun out in their field. And right now it's all clicking, so got to keep things going. Right now we're looking really good. Michael? Uh, I like to say our defense is pretty solid. We practice together. We play together. We, we do what we're supposed to do. We do our jobs. And we're, and a good, then, we're a good fundamental team. Woodlands, is, <laughs> Woodlands has always been about defense, right, with Coach Schmidt. But, you know, this year, you, you last year you had a great defense, and this year you've got a great offense to go along with that. So talk a little about how that takes the pressure off y'all to have a great offense. I can say it, it's pretty nice uh, not having to go out on the field after every three plays. But I'm really proud of our offense. They've been dropping dimes, scoring points. I'm, I'm really proud of them. And our defense has been doing really well, too. So. And, Zach, you were my player of the game for George Ranch. So, uh Give us a little bit about what, what it's like to have uh, to to have you know the offense just just coming out there and destroying teams. Man, it's it's a big confidence booster because we can go out in the field and you know whatever we're doing, we're still the big lead and big big uh, big support behind us. But it's a lot of fun out there. Um, our defense keeps balling out, offense balling up, putting up crazy numbers. It's a lot of fun. And then here we got the player, the defensive player of the game, Graham Milton. Two interceptions, one 50-yard touchdown return. Uh, what, what, you know, what did you think about that? That you know, is, is, is that your first pick six? Uh, first pick six on a varsity level, yes, sir. All right. <laughs> so uh, it's quite the adrenaline rush. Uh, I think it, I think it helped our defense just gain some momentum, get some hype going, and uh, I think we were able to build off of it. All right. So. And what and what do you think, Zach? About and I'll ask all three of them. What do you think about getting to represent the uh, the Region Two and coming down and hopefully getting to play against a, a Houston area team that you yeah. know you're just going to go through that you got to go up. What's what's it like going up north to play all those teams? I mean, we just went la or last week went to Beaumont. That was a two-hour drive, so that was quite a haul, our longest haul of the season. And we're used to it. we're ready to play. We're on that bus. We're getting our confidence ready. We're ready to go on that field and bust our asses for them. Michael, what's it like being in the district that's with with the Region Two teams? Uh, I mean, ah. Uh, we just got that we ball. We do what we do. It's Northeastern. <laughs> whoever we whoever we play, I can say we'll do what the Highlanders do. And Grant, just like my boy Mike said, we line up, we play ball. It doesn't matter who's on the field. All we know is we're on the field. All right. We're well, right I hope, congratulations so, on being undefeated, guys. Yes, sir, and man, keep on keep on balling out, guys. Yes, sir. We'll Thanks, do. guys. Thank All right. Thank you very much. No problem, man. LoneStarGridiron.com. Access the complete history of Texas high school football, over 100 years of information, win-loss records, coaching histories, individual stats, records, and more. Lone Star Gridiron, the authority on Texas high school football.